What is up guys, it's Miles here bringing you a little Demon Hunter video on how to gear a Demon Hunter and so let's just jump right into this. So basically what you're going to look for is your primary stats if you're either going to buy them on the auction house or so I hit uh, my windows tab either if you're going to look for on the auction house or just hope your luck works really good and finds them like playing in game. And basically, what your first primary stat is going to be dexterity, guys. Uh, you want to either look for 130 plus um, when you're searching in the auction house, or you're going to be looking for, uh, or your next stat is going to be critical hit damage, and that's your that's your big secondary, and then critical hit chance is your next one. You don't want to worry about resistances, um, at least I don't because I don't worry about dying. Um, I mean that's just me. Uh, I mean, I could survive pretty good with what I have right here. So basically, what you're going to look for, see, on my bow, I got 115 dexterity with critical hit damage increased by 81%. And I found this on the auction house for only 100k gold, and that's pretty good. I know it's not like the best, best bow ever, but, you know, it's it fits what I needed. Um, and on boots, if you're going to look in the auction house, look for 200 plus dexterity, um, and then you'll find crazy boots for crazy cheap. I think I got these for like 20k gold. Um, so for your quiver, what you're going to look for is dexterity is your main, like I said. And then try and get the highest attack speed. And then, because there's no critical hit damage on a bow, you could either get like something to increase a spell, or you could just get critical hit chance increase like I did. Because I don't have to worry about getting high hits with a spell or ability because my crit damage is just out the roof. And then I got some really nice pants, 183 dexterity. Um, I'm gonna be swapping out this ring really soon. And then I got, I found this ring. I wish the de vitality and dexterity switched, um, but it gives critical hit damage increase and critical hit chance increase. So that's really nice. Um, I crafted these a long time ago, 146 dexterity, 143 vitality. Not too shabby. Um, a belt, I think I bought an auction house for like 50k gold. 155 dexterity is just crazy um, in my mind. I crafted these as well, 109 dexterity with critical hit damage increased by 28 and this is just item level 62 so if I found like a plan that gives me like to craft 63's uh, gloves that'd be pretty nice but we'll see. Um, these are good like I said you're just primary stats are gonna be dexterity um, and then I'll show you what gear you're going to look for critical hit damage increased and in, uh, critical hit chance. Um, I got this. It gives, for on your torso, if you're going to get a cloak, try and get max discipline. And then dex, or it's going to be dexterity and then max discipline. And then hopefully you find some sockets. I'll be changing out these sockets very soon. Um, but it's really good. Uh, let's see. Helmet, 173 dexterity. I uh, can't go wrong with that because you can't really get, you can't get crit damage or crit critical hit chance and then for your amulet you're gonna look for dexterity and critical hit damage and now this is a really good one because 145 dexterity and critical hit damage increased by 57 percent which is just ridiculous I mean it's only an item level 61 so I'm sure there's a crap ton better ones but I like that one for now this is just helping me make inferno go faster like um, I mean I've already beat it but sometimes it can just give, be a real bore with my old gear, so I just swapped out a couple pieces. Um, but yeah, guys, that's that's basically all you want is just dex, critical hit damage, and critical hit chance, and then of course your max discipline on your chest piece. I mean, you can even get max discipline on your quiver too to give you more survivability. Because basically, I'm just a glass cannon, 12k DPS. So I'll show you what I hit for. Uh, hopefully I find a mob real quick. <clears throat> and basically guys, with sharpshooter, every three or every second goes up by 3%. And that's how you get a 100% critical shot. But watch the DPS scale like that. And I should have shot sooner because that lasher tail. But I hit him for like 200k was it? Or something like that. But yeah, so it's pretty nice guys. It's uh, really, really nice. Uh... I like it a lot more now, but see, you can see uh, it's scaling back up because with sharpshooter, after you shoot your one shot, it resets and then it just keeps scaling up till you get a hundred percent critical chance again, and then it stops and then it cuts off your DPS. 
and you can see my crit damage is 200 plus 234 percent which is ridiculous attack speed 1.71 um what else do i have Uh, that's pretty much it guys. I don't really have any magic fine gear. I mean, this is all my magic fine gear down here. But that that's it. That's just how you gear a demon hunter. Just You can either use the auction house. Uh, who cares if you buy crap from the auction house? It's there for a reason. Because um, people are going to find better gear than you. Um, I've been playing 300 plus hours. Maybe even, no, even more than that. That was like a couple weeks ago I had 300 plus hours. I have like 400 and I, I've only found like four rares no um, set items no like all type N uh, legendaries I farm act three like every day but you know that's just how the dice rolls and that's why some people find better gear than you on the auction house because they have the luck or the rolls to get that better gear but I'm gonna cut this video off I'd like to thank you all for watching and have a great day guys see ya